Texture is very important in the Super Blur Art movement. And also, things to put context to paintings, like for instance here, you'll see that formula. That is the Schrodinger's equation. Some people also refer to it as Schrodinger's cat. And yeah, so we also want to, I just want to show, although this is done on paper, this is acrylic ink on paper, uh, I also use just a normal ballpoint pen just to show what we can do, you know, just with determination if we don't have any mater other materials to work on. I try to make interesting figures which I sometimes refer to as Picassoification. Um, again, just the experimentation, I also use some type of mono printing or dual printing on some of these works on paper here. This is just uh, the context here is again a man is standing in, inside of a room and um, there's a painting of, you know, one of those outdoor paintings I'm making of the landscapes with the house with the red, normally a red roof. Here is a painting of an albatross. Um, the reason why these are an albatross is I wrote there the albatross. Again, just like a random painting, which I thought is quite interesting. Here again is what I refer to as Picassoification, sometimes, you know, very inspired by the Cobra art movement. Copenhagen, Copenhagen, Amsterdam, Brussels, Carl Oppel, Asker John, those type of artists. Also, because of vacation, is you know, I don't think anybody would have painted this way if it wasn't for Picasso. So, I refer to these type of paintings as because of vacation, and that's also a concept inside of the super blur art movement is vacation. We <laughs> Whenever you want to call something or it looks similar to something else, we call it vacation. Again, some Picasso vacation paintings, which uh, obviously very inspired by Asker John, Carl Oppel, some of the other, Stephen Rietveld, you know, just specific, specifically Stephen Rietveld with the, um, the red, blue, and yellow, which I think gives us more part of the style than being part of um, the Cobra art movement. So just a few works on paper. I hope you enjoy the video. And that is about it for today. Thank you.